Well, good day, train enthusiasts. Welcome to Train Mechanic Simulator. New game just released not too long ago. Um, I was asked by a few people to try this game out. So, I have tried the first couple of little missions just to kind of see how it was. And it's it's pretty good. Um, it It's pretty good, <laughs> we'll say. I haven't been, uh, say, we'll say, blown away yet by, like, this is an awesome game. But it's not too bad. Um, it's kind of like all the other simulator, uh, uh, mechanic simulator things, right? So, uh, so we're going to start a new game. Start a new game. And uh, there's a couple little tutorials here. So it says, uh, tutorial general rules of the game. Welcome to the Game Train Mechanic 2017. Uh, you are a mechanic and your task will repair rail vehicles in three different workshops. Ooh, that's sweet. Under your care will both be arcanic, I don't even know what that is, and simple steam engines, um, as well as very modern electric locomotives. Uh, each locomotive will be assigned to a garage adapted to repair this respective type. Good luck. Okay. Well, so far it's pretty like I need to have my vision checked. Let's have a look at the options here, see how everything's set up. Effects are on high. Medium high. Okay. Edge smoothing's on. Look like it changes. Depth of field is on. Actually, I like that better, I think. Depth. Hang on a sec. Let's go back in here. I just got to get everything all adjusted here. Depth of field on. Everything's blurry up there. I kind of like it off better. <laughs> Depth of field off. SSAO. I don't even know what that is. I guess on's pretty good. Must be something with the shadows. Reflections, shadows, high. I don't even really see that changing. Uh, screen camera, full screen on, 1920, 1080. Uh, I guess that's all good. Okay, so depth of field. Yeah, I kind of like it. Uh, I like it off. It just everything down here looked really blurry. Like down here, it looks a lot better, I think. Okay, so what do we got to do? Up there at the top left, M, job order. Go to office and accept work. Okay. So I presume... Oh, hydraulic workbench. That's cool. Nothing there. Mechanics workbench. Electrical workbench. Oh! <laughs> parts warehouse. I. This window, you can manage your spare parts. You can sell them, uh, then profit from the resale. So we'll uh, this profit from their resale will decrease the amount of the of the account. A better parts condition, the more profit you'll generate from it. Oh, that's good to know. I don't have any parts yet, I guess. T for tablet. The tablet is your information center. Here you can start online stores with parts. There are three shops for mechanics, hydraulics, and electrical systems. Okay. Improve your garage, go into the mechanics help center that describes all the operations of the game. Oh, so you have to pay. It's sort of like the uh, car mechanic simulator, too. You pay for better stuff, and you can fix stuff better. Oh, wait, tablet again. Okay, so there's all the parts. Nothing's open yet, because we have to get a job first. So, it looks like it goes outside. Okay. Staircase up here to nowhere, by the looks of things. There's a little room here, I guess. Looks like our office. That is our office. Well, there you go. Welcome to the work order acceptance system. Here you'll be able to accept work orders, missions, assignments to any given workshop. <coughs> In this window, you can switch between work orders or uh, to skip a given task and possibly finish it later. Oh, that's cool. So, oh, there we already got a job. Job order number one. Welcome to train uh, the game, Train Mechanic 2017. Uh, your first mission will be to simple train repair so you can become familiar with the basics of the game. Your task will be repairing a locomotive in which the steel and rubber springs in the front truck have been damaged. So that's our income and a bonus, I guess, for some something. Oh, okay, I guess we're getting into it here. 
So, it appears that the cause of the locomotive's malfunction is the damaged carriage. Probably they are the steel and rubber springs located. Locate the exact cause of the defect and place with new part. Place with a new part. Task amount 25, an estimated cost of over 11400 So I guess we can't go over the price of that. I don't know what happens if we do. But, uh, so what did that say? Uh, press here. Okay. We can't sell the parts. Oh, this is kind of cool. Parts warehouse. I don't have parts yet. Okay, so train. There we go. That's pretty cool. All right. I don't know why the train's moving or am I moving. I think I'm moving, but if you look here long enough, it looks like the train's moving. Uh, anyway, so okay. As we. In this mode, you can strip down locomotives taking apart their available components. Uh, often to be able to get a part, you'll need to remove other parts or even those operating properly. Even those operating properly. Oh, interesting. Please remember about this. Don't forget. Okay, so I guess if you hover over something and it's like, you know, you can take that part off, but this part has to come off first kind of thing that's what they're saying there so we want to do testing mode I think installation disassembly testing mode in this mode you can check the condition of various train elements to eliminate the probability of the repair profitability of the repair remember the higher the level of wear of an individual element the greater risk of unsuccessful repair of the element okay so we're looking for something spring Oh, I just had it there. Steel and rubber springs. Okay, so, oh, got to hold the mouse down. That one's green. I guess that means good. Oh, that one's red. That's not good. Oh, that one's red. That's not good. That one's green. Okay. So, I think that's all they said. So, we'll, uh... Oh, oh that's cool. Center camera. Okay. Okay, so... We need to do disassembly mode now. Oh yeah, you can see they're even like rusty looking, right? Even though this is kind of rusty here too, but so we need to oh, move great big these bolts through the frame of the truck trailer thingy. Okay, so that one's out. That one was good. all the controls here. That one only had two bolts holding it on. Okay, so that's they so they say that's it on the report. So now I guess we have to try to fix these things. It won't be electrical, probably mechanical. Uh, specific sub-assemblies may be repaired on the workbench. We have divided them into three categories, mechanics, hydraulics, and electrical. The cost of the repair will be added to the account. The difficulty is that there is no certainty as to the success of the repair. Ooh, that's different. If the repair is successful, the part will be repaired at a percentage of 90 to 100 percent. If however we don't manage to regenerate the part, it will be even more damaged. <laughs> The price of the repair is significantly lower than the purchase of new parts. The more involved, the more involved, improved, sorry, the workbench, the greater the, the chance of repair. So, yeah, that makes sense. Oh, 5%? What does that mean? Status is at 5%. Chance of success, 100%. Oh, okay, well, that's good. Yay! Repair, 100%. I guess it tells you it's only 20% chance of actually fixing this, so just get rid of it get a new one. Okay, so I guess that's it. We fixed! So we have to go to install mode. And I see the little highlight, so we select that guy. Drive a couple of bolts in, select this dude. This guy gets extra bolts for some reason. Okay, and I don't think we... Oh, I missed that screen. I think it said it looks like everything was fixed. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, so I guess we go to our job order. Finish order. So, 
Cost of the order on the account, $9,120. Ooh, ooh. Minimum parts condition have to be at least 70%. So that's good. We saved them a bit of money. Okay, that's, that's one done. Out you go. Oh yeah, there's our total. Nice yeah, member to use your earned cash to improve your workshop by using a tablet. Okay. We'll have to get a couple of jobs under our belt first. So, can we go outside? Work is selected. Are you sure you want to leave the garage? Um, okay. Probably have to go take another mission. Repair. Oh, we're at a train? Wow. Increase engine power, decrease engine power. Space is breaking. Rotate the camera. Okay. And it looks like normal train sim. Horn. Tab. Oh, that sounds pretty good. So this is a pretty huge place here. My goodness. Steam engine depot. That's good to know. Uh, electric electric engine depot. Okay, that must be the, the fixy place. Diesel engine depot. Wow, there you go. So it looks like there's a bit of driving or training. Huh. So what do we got on here for a car? Oh, it's like a crane. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so I guess we have to go backwards here, so go back to our shop. Oh, there we go. There's no lights on the train. There's all kinds of lights all over the train, but I can't turn the lights on on the train. Look at them all. So where is this going to take us? I guess we got to follow... It should take us right into, right into the soy coal back here. Oh, the brakes even spark. That's kind of cool. Go to notch 8. Ooh, that takes off pretty quick. Oh, okay. Return to the engine diesel. Yes, let's return. Grab another mission. I don't know how many we're gonna do these missions today. It just depends how long you take, I guess. But uh, we'll give you a, give you some play of it. See if you guys like it. If it comes out, you like it, then we'll play some more. But if not, then we'll find something else to play, I guess. <laughs> Order number two: The driver complains about faulty brake system. Locate the cause of the defects and make repairs. This work order is slightly more difficult. Remember that each player type is repaired on a different workbench. Each part type is played repaired on the workbench. If you're not able to repair the part yourself, you can buy a new part from the store using the tablet. All right, here she comes. Ooh, blue one. Ooh, blue one. Okay, so part looks like there's three things that need fixed. Locate the faulty components of the braking system in the front truck. Task income two hundred fifty dollars. We can't spend more than fifty-seven. Front truck. So. So that should be the front. Okay, so we want to go to test mode and look at brake stuff. So it's a brake caliper arm. That's good. Hydraulic brake piston. That's good. Hose. That's good. That one's good. Brake caliper. Good. Brake caliper arm, brake caliper. That's good, that's good. It must be all on this side then. There must be discs somewhere there. Motor, electric motor. No. That's brake caliper. Caliper arm. Big piston. That one's good. That one's good. That's good. That's good. Draw it. Oh, I can see the rust on it. Look, look at the rust on it. That one's the junk one. Yeah. He's not happy, but 
There's three parts broken. Oh, here and here, I bet. Caliper arm, yep. And brake caliper. Look at that. Three brokey parts. Okay, so disassembly mode. Oh, yeah, look at that rust now on them. Oh, they're junk. We've got to take that line off. Big piston. That's the expensive hydraulic stuff. Ooh, wee. One bolt holding that whole entire assembly on. Okay, uh, we're on the wrong side here. So now we gotta go to probably the mechanics workbench and the hydraulic workbench. So, workbench repair. Chances of success 31%. Oh, good. Fix that one. Uh, wrong workbench, wrong workbench. Okay, let's see what repairs. Cut out success, that's good. Probably just needs paint. <laughs> okay, and the hydraulic brake piston. 20%. So that'll be hydraulic stuff. Repair. Status 20. Chances of success 31. This is going to be expensive one. Please repair it. Oh, yeah. And brake hoses. It's 97%. Doesn't say repair that, but... Costs 100. Ah, well, so that's the way it is, I guess. So, uh, installation mode. It's kind of nice it tells you what part to put on. That one. That one. And the piston. Expensive part. Imagine once you upgrade your garage, you'll get more of a speedier wrench. And the brake hose. And I think we're good. That was a quick repair. Finish order. So we uh, had 5,700. We only cost them 4,471. That's pretty good. Nice. Maybe we should update our garage here. Bonus for achievement. Oh, $1,000 for that. That's pretty good. Let's uh, have a look at this here now. Screw gun. Oh, there you go. Mechanics workbench, hydraulic workbench. I don't mind the screw gun so much, but I wouldn't mind improving. Let's do that first one. Oh, you can go under the train too. That's cool. I'm going to have to try that. Okay, task number three. We're just blowing through these. Oh, sometimes the task will involve finding and repairing locomotives. Finding? Really? Uh, that were damaged somewhere on the roots of the game world. Of the game world. And then towing them off. Oh, that's what the tow thing is for. The crane stuff. Okay. Towing them off to the appropriate workshops and making repairs. For this purpose, you'll use a special repair train, which we've already seen. Uh, this time, a diesel locomotive broke down in square D1. Must be something on the map. Uh, locate it and tow it to the workshop. We suspect a truck failure. Ooh. Oh, that's kind of cool. So I presume I've got to go outside to our repair tree. Okay. That's kind of cool. We have to tow a train in? Ooh, that's going to be fun. Find the locomotive in square D1 and tow it to the workshop. Okay, so if we open up this, so... Okay, so I see. So D is way over here, and one, one is here. So we got to go to this square here some, somehow. We got to get from <laughs> all the way down here, and hope that the oh boy, hope that all the tracks are. I bet you we're gonna have to. Uh... Oh, look at that! It changes everything for you. Okay, so we're gonna end up. Looks like this, the green, I guess, is the way it's going. So green, green. Take us all the way around here. We could change this one. Okay, so that one. Okay, so that switched. That 
switch, so we're going to go up here now. North Tunnel. Do we see a North Tunnel yet? North Station. So we're only to right there yet. Okay. You guys watch the train stuff if you want. I'll try to figure a route out here. Um, South Central. Or South Center. That just came in, so that's the right way. North Tunnel, though. We want that to change. Get it going a little faster here. draws a little orange line for you too, I see. Okay, but now we don't want to go that way. We want West Asian Valley to go straight. West Asian Valley. South Suburban Station. I think that should be good. Yeah, okay. of it's all set, we should end up in this D1. What I can see anyways. It's going to go that way, it's going to go that way, it's going to go this way, it's going to go that way. Straight, it's going to go left. Maybe I'll do this loop up around here. So north boundary east, we want to change that. Should be good. Juice it. Pretty tight little turns here and there on this uh, track system. Yeah, we're going to be up there pretty quick. <laughs> going this speed. We're not even up to full pop yet. Imagine it'd be one of those big green things around like that. Uh, last one. So, holy cow, 60 kilometers now. Yeah, I'm going to have to slow this down. I don't want to derail myself. Hit the brakes. Oh, she stops fast. Stops really fast. So technically now, if we get this train and go backwards, we should go the same way. Unless stuff gets changed on us again. We ought to have to figure all out a route again. Kind of if you had to stop, get out, and change the switch like you do in the new train set. I must say, there's smoke coming out. It's pretty nice, though. Holy oh, jeez, we're going to go off the end of the bridge here? Oh, I see. There's the train up there. Oh, of course, it cuts to... Okay, so we're automatically hooked on, probably, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> now, let's have a look at the map. So, if we go backwards... Oops. Go backwards... I think everything's set except North Station isn't set. Although we could, er, we could just keep. Yeah, that's that's all good. That's yeah, okay. Okay, so let's go backwards. Let's see if we can derail this thing. That'd be awesome. Camera hole. There's an inside too. That's kind of cool. Interactive controls, so I guess it's just all talking about the keyboard stuff. Two views. I wonder if they actually have a derail thing on this. It's just going to take it all. So far, I'm doing it. <laughs> That's pretty wicked turns there. Oh, we're not going to be long getting back. This is going to be a wicked turn here. I wonder if it's going to do that. Ooh, 
scary. She stays on under the track. Going full pop backwards. Oh, I hit the brakes. My bad. Okay, we're still good. Oh, no. We went the wrong way. We did. Darn it. One track was... One switch wasn't right. pop too. I guess I didn't uh, catch that one. Now, what else could we do here? We could uh, just switch this front one, I guess. There. Where does that get us? Now, why is this one taking us that way when it's actually green down here? Diesel engine depot. There, now we're good. Okay. Now we're good. We just have to actually get uh, over, over there somewhere, I think it is. Yeah, you can see the green. You just see the green right there. That's where we got to get to. Ah, uh, this will still work. We're going in the wrong way, but I'm probably not going to matter. Ooh, that's a sharp turn. <laughs> Actually slowed me down a whole lot there trying to get around there. Still here, train? Yeah. All right, I guess we're a tow uh, train company too, so we'll go see and hear what's wrong with this thing. Restored, restored properly and towed to the work workshop. I think it was supposed to be towed properly. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so bring her in. Let's have a look at her. Find the locomotive. Okay, we did that. Uh, just as we expected, the problem proved to be the damaged damaged transmission in the truck. Remove and replace them. Task him 250. We've got. Uh, 87,400 to spend. Ooh, this is going to be expensive. And there's two things broken. Oh, I think I can see them already. <laughs> All rusty. So, three test mode. Drive gear. Yep. Drive gear. Yep. Okay, disassembly mode. Oh, i got to take this out first. Get that off. Okay. Now. Uh, so these are all the parts we just took off. Uh, that'd be probably mechanical. So that is, that's good repair. Ooh, chance of success 15%. I don't like that. This one's a little better. It's a, that's 15%. So what am I supposed to do here? Because the chance of success isn't very good. Am I supposed to buy new ones? And right there they want 40, 50, 60, 72 grand right there to repair those. And I may not even repair them. And uh, so now what do I do here? Uh, that would be mechanical parts, I think. Holy, you guys see any transmission parts here? There it is, drive gears. 46,000. 86. 92,000, but I've only got... Uh, I've only got... 87,000. That doesn't work, but I'm not going to fix them if I can't fix them. 
Maybe I'm supposed to, uh... Maybe we did... We did that, but... That's not good. <laughs> I don't... I think I'm just gonna buy them, because I don't want to waste some money and fix them when I can't fix them. So, I guess we're gonna lose a bit of money off of this one. Because I'd rather not waste the money and not be able to fix it, so... Add to cart, add to cart, a shopping cart, 92 grand. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> uh, I don't know if that's such a good thing. Oh, well, it's not my train. Over budget, sorry. Uh, so, two installation mode. So I guess I get to keep these parts now. I'm not really sure what to do. I guess I was supposed to skip that job, maybe, and then do it. From, you know, I probably had more chance of repairing it when uh, I had a higher workbench there. But um, okay, finish order. We're a little for budget. Sorry about that. Um, oh, we're not too bad actually. 83. Okay, so I guess that worked. All right, that was I think number three. Total. Bonus for completing achievement. Bonus for low cost. Okay, well, I guess that worked out. Well, let's see. Maybe we'll do another one here. What's the next one? The main railway station has informed us that a locomotive pulling a passenger car has not arrived on time. Check what happened. Uh-oh. Check. So I, that sounds like i got to go out here again. I hope it tells me kind of where to go. <laughs> I don't know where to go, so... Better let me know something. Find the derail train near the Coast Square E4. E. E. 4. Oh, it's not too far from me here. So there's E. 4. So it should be in the coast here somewhere. Okay, so we got a. Go here, here. It's already set for us. Oh! <laughs> Sure. Oh yeah, we're already set. Okay. Not too far, so we don't need to juice her too hard, I wouldn't think. All oh, the brakes work pretty awesome on this thing. Lots of sparks, so let's have a look at the sparks. Ooh, sparky. That's kind of cool. So, I want to figure out what happened here. What happened? It should be right in here somewhere. Let's put her down to notch one. Anything derailed here yet? Don't see anything yet. Oh, if it's derailed, maybe we have to use this crane thingy. That'd be kind of sweet. Hopefully, it's pretty cool. It's not, you know, too robotic, we'll say. I didn't see anything derailed. We're right at the coast here now. I guess we're just starting into the coast. Give it a couple of notches. Oh, there's a green thingy coming up. Oh, okay. A green thingy. Find a derail train near E4. Yeah, the coast is clear E4. Oh, I see a derail train. That's not a good place to be sitting. circle. <gasps> Press X to start crane mode. Oh, no X. Oh, I see. 
Oh, crane. Uh, boom, W, and S. This is going to be a lot of controls. Okay, that's the boom in and out. Okay. Rotate. A, D. Height, Q, and E. Q. Okay, E goes up. So we're going to need it up and out. And then we got to go this way. Oh, and then we got a uh, rotating object line. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, I'm no. That's why it's not hooking up. There we go. Oh boy. So I've got to do what here? Pick him up and stretch him out so he doesn't hit my my crane. Heavy train. We'll go over. That's pretty sweet. Rotate an object. Okay. And then we gotta put them down. Oh, that's up. Oh, there we go. Tow the train to the train depot. So, if we go backwards, again, looks like it'll take us right there. Oop, no, we want to drive it. So we got to figure out what happened to this guy now. It's like weird stuff all over my screen, like got behind a glass and it's all covered in train goo or something. Let's just juice her. See what, see what happens. We're gonna crash. We jumping. We're coming in really hot. Full, full tilt. the train. <gasps> took us the wrong way again, but it says green. And you know what? We looked at we looked at the map and it actually diverted us right, right into here. Why did that change it? Why did that change on us? I think it did that to us before. Well isn't that silly? So now we're gonna have to drive back. Let's wait to drive back. But I checked that when we first left, and it, and yeah, the orange liney thing was right into the depot here. So I don't know what's going on there. Very strange. But that's okay. We can get up here and then um, switch to the tracks. why I did that because it was fine. It throws you for a loop, I guess. I don't know. Here, a little, little few bugs. They probably have to come up with a, a fix for that, I would think. A patch. Fix the switches.
All right, let's see why this one derailed. Something wrong with them. Go to repair. What's the matter with your truck? Ooh, lots of parts. Appears that the problem is damaged engine mounts both in both trucks. Ooh. Damaged engine mounts. That sounds expensive. So I see rusty parts here and here. Engine mountings. Okay, so let's just do a test for teammates here. Yep. Yep. How many was there? One, two. So there's other parts here too that are bad. Don't see anything else rusty here, but let's, uh, let's tear this apart here. Oh, lots of screws. I need to take all these parts out, and it doesn't really make a difference <laughs> to what holds on. That looks pretty rusty there, too, but it didn't say anything about brakes. It said engine mount stuff. Oh, this one's got way more screws. Oh, are those things junk too? Mounting brackets. Let's do a test on them. Oh, they're okay. Nine percent. Wow, this one is well screwed in. Okay, so let's just do some some tests here and see. Everything else looks alright. Everything's all right here. It looks pretty good. So both trucks. So we'll inspect this one too. Yeah, pretty rusted. Pretty rusted. All oh, these things look rusty too. That's where other parts right there. I bet. Yep. 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 Okay. Twenty five percent. Wow. Might be able to fix that one. This would have been nicer with a faster wrench. All right. Parts are out. Um, hydraulics. I don't have hydraulics. Probably all mechanical stuff. Ooh. So, chance is 100%, that's good. Fix that, just needs to do paint. Chance 100, 100, 100, 100, 100. Oh, that's good. So just paint everything again, and away we go. Yeah, 
Yeah, why don't we just repair those two while we're here? Should be all nice and new going back on then. $64 to repair it and everything's 100%. Okay, reassembly now. So, need one of those. And this one didn't need those other pieces. It was the easier thing. Oh no, I did need those parts. Those other brackets that we had to fix. These guys way down here. Okay, that truck's set. Someone's texting me. Buzz off. What do you... What do you want? Sorry. i to turn that off. Okay. Oh, no, we don't want that. Okay, so where are we here? we got to go to the other truck. Do the same. So this game, while we're doing this, I'll tell you about this game here. Uh, it's on Steam. For $16.99. I didn't think it was too, too bad. And it's not a very big game. It's only 684 megabytes. It's pretty small. Compared to, like, Grand Theft Auto, which is, like, 60 gigabyte. All the files, right? I don't know how much we get to do in this. It's probably going to be kind of limited, but... Okay. I think we're repaired. Let's have a look at our work order. Nope. Missing... Oh, yeah, it's those little bracket things. Where did they go? Oh, I missed a bracket here. How did I miss those? Did I miss something else? I probably did. I missed electric motor mounting brackets. Uh, no. Must have missed something. Electric motor mounting brackets. What did I miss? I don't see anything here. Oh, finish order. Oh, okay. I don't know why I thought I missed them, but I, for some reason I thought I missed them. Um, okay, so we're good. Estimated of the cost was seventy-eight ninety, and it costs at only fifty-seven forty-seven. That's pretty good. Looks like we're getting stuff here too, or something. Better. Yay! All right, how'd we do? Do some more upgrading, maybe. Two thousand dollars. Woo! -wee, we did pretty good there. Um. Okay. So that's. Nope. 
tablet. Let's uh, improve our workshop. Uh, we'll do maybe that one and that one and maybe a wrench. There, now we'll be a little speedier on the wrench. Oh, I haven't got under a train yet. I keep forgetting. Ooh, we can... Got a whole bunch of stuff to work on now. Trouble number five. Locomotive was damaged during the transportation of goods. The rear truck is damaged and requires urgent repair. Let's do that one. We'll do a couple more here, maybe. I'll see how we're doing for time. Ooh, lots of parts. Estimated cost is 40850 Make necessary repairs to the truck assembly. We remember to check all the relevant elements that could be damaged. Task of 500 Okay, so let's try walking under the train here. Well, that's kind of cool. Doesn't really make a huge difference for... Um, So there's some broken stuff back here, I think. So all these are junk. There's a bunch of broken parts. Let's do test mode. That one's good. 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 That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Well, there's not much broken here. They're saying there's all kinds of broken parts. The frame itself is good. Must be on the other truck because none of this stuff is broken. me that looks like it's junk. Yeah, that one's no good. That one's good. That one's good. That one's good. Oh, this doesn't look too good down here. No. That line doesn't look good. Nope. These axle things look pretty good though. You can sort of tell by the rusty of it things, right? This doesn't look good here. Nope. This one doesn't look good. See, this one here will turn out fine, probably. Yeah. Oh, lots of parts are broken. So, they're supposed to be, uh... Two not found. That's not good. So that's not found. Okay, well, let's start disassembling. Seeing more rusty parts though here. Uh, test mode. Everything else looks good. Okay. Now, how to get this part off? This one first, I guess.
Now I don't like the looks of those cylinders, uh, those, those pistons there. Now here they look fine. Uh, it's junk. I think the other one was junk too. Let's just. Uh, Quickly throw this back on and we'll do a test so that it tells us in the. So I don't. Oh, damper. Okay, so it does. Okay, so we can. Ooh, these are going to be expensive parts. Okay, let's get out of here. I think that's all mechanical stuff again. Now, uh, if I open up that. Yeah, those hydraulic brake pistons are still good. So, let's hit our workbench. Um, hydraulic brake hose, chance. I guess that's not good. <laughs> Repair that, 100% chance. 66% chance. That's yeah, that should be pretty good. Oh, the part is even more damaged. Oh, that's not good. The axle box is junk. Can't repair that. 66. I don't think I want to try to repair those again. And that one we could repair. So we need to buy two piston dampers and then two axle boxes. And Sev. So mechanical parts. Need a uh, damper, axle box, five grand a piece. There's ten grand gone. Axle box, there's sixteen grand gone. Oh, twenty-six grand. Order. Okay. Should have parts. Uh, installation mode. Oh, we didn't get a fuel or a hose either. Five grand for shock, eh? Wow. That's an expensive shock. Try to put the dirty part back on it. Now I could probably use my own money and then sell those again, I would think, if it's repairable. Okay, and this part. Pistons. Go back. This one you can go back. Oh, they're going a little faster in the guess. Eh? This part, I think we needed to. Say parts have to be seventy percent. I don't think I can fix that one, so we'll have to buy a new called hydraulic brake hose. Uh, so tablet hydraulics. Five grand for a hose. There we go. Did we fix her all up? A lot of draw a rake piston connector. What did we miss? Oh, is that one broken? It is too. Oh, it's 
Oh, that one's broken. Oh, I have to take the whole part off. Can't you just take these things off? Just take this nut off here, right? And then pull it down. Guess not. Take the whole thing off. Okay, so can we fix that part? Save a bit of money here, hopefully. Um, yes, we can. Yay. Okay. Installation. Hopefully we come in on her budget. All right, how do we look? Yeah, not too bad. Cost of the order thirty-seven five ten. We had uh, forty thousand. Well, that's pretty good. Except, no missing parts. What? What did we forget? Oh, the hose. That would help. <laughs> Now, can we finish order? Yay, we can finish order. Oh, now we're over budget, though. How do we go over budget by just putting a hose back on? Labor. Well, I did what I could, but we shouldn't have repaired that part. I guess we should have just bought it. We wasted money on that repair. Oh, we still got a grand out of it, I guess. It's pretty good. All right, should we do one more mission here and uh, see... We're looking. Let me just uh, pause for a second. I'll go look and see uh, how long our video is so far. All right, maybe we'll do one or two more here. We're just over an hour, I see. So try to maybe finish these two. Ah, uh, so job six. The locomotive drove over the. Oh, a locomotive drove over something lying on the track. Pardon me. The front truck of the wheel axle wheel set axle requires servicing. All right, bring her in, boys. Bring her in. Front truck. The brake system is damaged, find the cause of defect, and make repairs. Task. Okay. And how much do we got to spend? 20 grand. Less than 20 grand. So the brake system's got problems. I see a bad line. Testing mode. No, that line's good. That's good. Good, that's good. Is that the front truck? Is it an advantage? Find the cause effects. Oh, it doesn't say which trucks. So it's probably the rear, because everything looks pretty good here. It's probably the rear truck. Although it's deceiving looking, it doesn't look damaged to me. fair bit of money. Something's got to be damaged somewhere. This is a mysterious one. Here's the brake system in the 
is damaged, find the cause of the defect, make repairs. I got almost 20,000 to spend, so. Normally you can see those rusty parts, right? some parts that are bad. Oh boy, those are going to be expensive. Uh, I'll just check all these two. There must be another wheel set back here that's not in good shape. That one. Well, that's expensive, I bet. I wonder what a wheel axle's worth. Don't know if we could repair that or not. Uh, let's open the tablet here. What are the mechanical parts? So less than 20000 to spend. There's 21000 so I don't know if we can fix it or not, but let's get her tore out of there. First of all, we got to take off that and then this. The axle box. That'd be the same on both sides here. Total disassembly. My goodness, it's only one axle. much left. Okay, uh, let's go over to our mechanical bench. Um, chance of repair is 100%. Just needs paint. All the other bits and pieces look good, so alright, let's go throw her back together. Oh, look, it's even, the part's even out too, that's cool. Installation mode. Okay, here we go. Put them set of wheels back in. Engine mount in. Put the axle boxes in. Put the shock on. That shock on. And all this running gear brake stuff.
drive gear. Motor something shaft thingy. I think that's it. Are we reassembled? Finish order. Come two grand. So we came in under budget. That's good. All ready to roll, literally. <laughs> ready to roll. We don't turn two grand from that. That's not too bad. Well, let's go in here and see. We got uh, the one mission left for here, and then it probably goes into steam stuff or something. Uh, job seven. The locomotive stopped on the trash. Cannot, cannot move. It appears that there's a problem with the traction motors. It must be towed, so we have to go pick them up. Seven of 25 missions. I imagine that's all there is in this game is 25 missions. All right, where is he? Probably way over on the other side. We got to find our route. <laughs> Try to bring him back. Just helicopter him here. Final Mokono of an A4. Yeah, that's like... That's like... Way over here, but at the bottom. A4. So, we gotta go that way. So, we'll have to come out. And back her up. All the way to A4. I guess it doesn't matter which route we take there, because it'll all end up there. Okay, we'll go out to the switch right here and uh, we'll stop and then back her up. Okay, I think we can just give her. Uh, it doesn't matter which way the track takes us, I guess, uh, this way. Either way it goes, it's all going that way anyways. There's nothing that really matters. The station should be A4 over here somewhere. I don't know where exactly, but it could be on this line. It could be on, hopefully it's on this line. I bet you it's on this line, though. I bet you. Hopefully we can see... Uh, Circly thingy when we get over here. It doesn't actually let us go into this other station here, anyways. It's forbidden. <laughs> yeah, there's trains, train cars in there, so that's why. Why the damn is locomotive on the tracks? So, we should go over here somewhere. Where's my green? Circle thingy. Green circle thingy. Where'd you go? Not quite there, I guess, yet. A4. I bet you it's, uh, I bet you it's up here. Take it this way. It's probably not going to take it the exact way, right? But I can't see my thing. Get into her now. Where is it? 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 Oh no, I don't see it. Oh, it is up there too. Okay, that should get us to it. It's a pretty cool game. It's different, that's for sure. Mechanic stuff too, and driving the train as well. So it's kind of a best of both worlds kind of thing, right? It's got a really good horn. Oh, we gotta crane them off. 
X. He is flipped. Okay, now we got to figure all this out again. Crane out. And up. We're definitely going to out more. And over. Is there like a different mode? No, there's no other mode. go up. Too many controls. Actually, I actually want to put the... No. Oh, what am I doing here? There, that's what I want to do. Pick the boom up. I'll get a hangover eventually here. Rotate you a little. There we go. Huh? Oh, is it going the wrong way? It is too. I know what's going on here. Up. It wants me to rotate it right around. That's why we're not right. So we'd have to ro rotate her around. There we go. Okay, let's take her home. Uh, map. Now, if we keep go going this way, that's kind of not where we want to go. I think we're better to go backwards still. Basically, should take us right there. I like to go around and explore a bit more to see where we end up, but uh, we'll eventually get her here. Steam Engine Depot. back for some repairs. This will be probably our last mission for today, and you guys uh, let me know if you will, if you uh, liked this game. I thought, I thought it was good. There's definitely a little more to it than, uh, you know, just driving in the train sim game. There's, uh, like I say, the best of both worlds in this, right? So, and a sweet horn. No bell, though. figure out what's wrong with this thing. Now, if we wanted to be really crafty here, we could come this way and then come in backwards to the train depot. Maybe we could do that. Westlake Station. Westlake Station go that way. And then West Station. No, West Station go that way. Switch to diesel engine depot. Go that way. That one should be good. Now this one, I don't know. Diesel engine depot. We're not there far enough yet, so. Diesel 
Tail Engine Depot. We'll have to play with that when we get a bit closer here. We can see it pop, pop, pop. Should be, should be the next one. Tail Engine Depot. I have no idea which way it's going to take us yet. That'll back us in the right way, which is, you know, doesn't matter because it just warps you in anyways, but it's uh, the right way to go anyways. Diesel Engine D Depot. Let's switch that and see where that takes us. Yeah, so that should take us right in. All right. Get her in the right position. We'll just back her in. You know, we could have done it the other way and drove in. That's a tight corner. <laughs> All goes well. Bang, bang, bang. And we go. And yeah, we'll see what's wrong with this one. I can't remember what they mentioned, but I think it was just disabled or something like that. So it's probably a transmission thing. Or something. I kind of hope this gets into, like, actual diesel engine stuff, but I kind of doubt it will. It'll just be the running stuff, so... You know, like the what we've been doing, I, I kind of highly doubt it gets into, like, actual engine stuff. Alright, so, find and ca find the cause of the defect in the traction motors task. We've got 51,000 to spend. So, traction motors. Looks like these things, I think. Well, that doesn't look good. Junk, junk, junk. That one's good. That one's good. That one's good. I think all this looks all right here. So let's disassemble. Uh, we did that one. Disc okay. Yeah. These things look pretty bad too. No, they're good. Okay, they're good. You get the right spot here. There, that's better. Uh, disassembly. Nikes, there's another one down here. There's a shaft bad there too. Yep. Just can't get into the the view I want here. Pretty rusted looking crap. in here though so let's I think this is all good yeah I think that was that was all good so we'll put all that back in that'd be an expensive part Ooh. okay so that's the stuff Uh, it's not too good here either. It's alright. 
Okay, so mechanical stuff. Chance of fixing that is 15%. That's not good. This one is, though. Chance of electric motor covers 100%. are all good so we're gonna have to buy a drive gear and that shaft is okay drive gear chance of repair uh, that's not good now just for fun chance of repair is 15% there let's go in here and upgrade this Fun. Chance repairs 31% now. Please, 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 please. Oh. That wasn't good. Um, so we're going to need to buy drive gear. That just cost us a pile of money. Uh, let's go to the tablet here, and then there'll be mechanical parts. Oh, that's going to hurt our budget. Drive gear is 46 grand. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. <laughs> That's going to hurt us a little bit. Well, look, you can see the controls inside the cab here. That's cool. Wait a minute, did I not buy that drive gear? Huh? No, I guess I did. My bad. Well, we got her now. Probably should be under the carriage, but now these parts look crappy. They look okay here, though. Okay, I think that's everything installed from there. Engine motor cover. Ah, yes, those things. Oh, yes, and this thing with all the bolts in it. How could I forget? Let's get our percentage of repair one up a bit. It's costing a lot of money, though. Okay. Did I miss something again? Oh, for cornflakes. Seriously? How did I miss that? I guess I'm so fed up with taking these things on and off. We've done so many of them today. I'm just like, get it done. Now we should be good. Finish order. So, yeah, we, we were quite a bit over cost there. <laughs> Whoops. That's not good. All right, so that is that for that. We didn't get a low-cost bonus, of course, so that sucks. <laughs> but anyways, 
Okay, I think I don't know what's going to happen here now because there wasn't any more missions, but... Oh, there is a number eight. We played on a locomotive that has a problem running uphill. It appears the problem was with the main engine. Oh, ooh, the locomotive must be urgently repaired. It. Okay, we might have to do this one before we go. We'll do this one and then, then we'll call it a day. This is main engine. That's what I wanted to do. Here's the engine parts are damaged, making us the repairs, task income. Okay. Ooh. This is pretty cool. Wow. So what's... Oh, cool. Crankshaft is not in good shape, I don't think. Rusty parts here. It shouldn't be, right? So we'll have to test everything, I guess. Engine parts are cool. Something's not good. Oh, I can see this cover here. Duh. Okay, so the valve cover. Wait a minute, how much do we have to spend here? $8,100. How much is a valve cover? $2,000. There's got to be something else going on here, too. and stuff in there. More engine covers. Okay, so all the combustion chambers are good. Okay, so there's a problem. Must be something under here. So let's... Uh, that oh look at all this crap that's not good <laughs> oh wow <laughs> uh maybe they're not all junk though i don't know but man man there's a lot of parts in here no i don't think they're all junk but well that is how many things so wow Fuel hose connector. No, if I'm not found, Valkyrie. Two more things that are junk here somewhere. That one. And that one. And that one's good. Oh, so that's not too bad. Disassembly mode. So we need to get. Whoa, jeez. There are fuel lines or something here. Fuel hose connector. Oh yeah. Okay, so this assembly mode. Take out the fuel lines. Oh, geez, I don't need to get in that far. I think we got everything off here. So, wrong side. No, oh, we were on the right side. No, we are on the wrong side. <laughs> like, then, I don't remember seeing these shelves here. Not hydraulics, it'd probably be all mechanic stuff. 
So we can repair the valve cover. Probably just need to do gaskets and paint. Um, why are there only two bad ones? Wrong workbench. Wrong workbench. Repair. Oh, we can repair all these two. I thought there was something else damaged here as well, though. Did we get everything? Missed the first guy. I got jumping ahead of myself. Okay, now we can fix everything. Wrong workbench. those things. Alright. Let's put her back together. Fuel holes. Oh, you get rid of the piston there. That's kind of cool. Fuel hose. Fuel connector. Fuel hose. Fuel hose. Fuel connector. Fuel hose. Fuel hose. Too many, too many cylinders. Fuel connector. Come on, fuel hose. Fuel hose. Fuel hose. Valve cover. All right. We are good, and we came in under budget this time, so that's good. All right. Finish order. Made some money out of that one. That's pretty good. Engine work should be worth a lot of money. All right, I think we've done pretty good. Uh, just gonna check and see what. There's still another mission here. Oh, there's a whole bunch more come up. <laughs> so I guess there's maybe 25 here, 25 at the other places. I don't know. But uh, that's probably for today. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm actually quite enjoying it. This one's got. Uh, Part of the gray smoke rising. Oh, oh, summer state. Oh, oh, that'd be engine problems. During the test ride, the driver complained that the engine runs too loudly. Oh, that'd be probably some kind of engine something. Train brake has a system failure located to damage elements. Another brake system. Train has a problem with the fuel fuel tank. It's leaky and so some fuel leaking from it. Oh, that's not good. Probably another line. But uh, yeah, anyways, we'll. Um, Play some more of this if you guys are if you guys are interested and if you like it. I'm pretty good with it actually. It seems pretty straightforward so far. I like to get into the uh, steam stuff. That'd be kind of that'd be tricky a bit. But anyways, that's it for today. Let me know in the comments what you think, and we'll catch you later. Thanks again for watching, and have a good day.